Porter, how tough is it to address the locker room after a night like this? Very tough. Very tough. Um, because, um, you know, it's, uh, you're, you're, I'm, I'm, dis I'm, I'm, I'm disappointed that the way we came out in the second half. Um, and uh, I thought in the first half we did some things game plan wise. We got some shots. Um, some didn't fall. We had, but we, I mean, overall, we looked, we said hey, we got some good looks against them. Um, we, you know, we were, we were within striking distance and um, the starters, the indic it was indicative of how we started defensively. I mean, and offensively, both ends. I mean, so it was very hard. Um, but the bottom line is, Bob, we had to play really well to beat Texas Tech tonight. We needed a lot of really good performances to beat Texas Tech tonight. And we didn't have them. We didn't have them. So whether you lose by that much or this much, it's it's a loss you got to put in the bank. We, we got to move forward. We got to move forward, and get their minds right. So it's hard because at one moment you want to be like, you know, I'm just I'm upset at a lot of things. But on the other hand, you know, we've got to move past this. We got Oklahoma State coming up Saturday, a, a huge game, and uh, we got to move past it. Appreciate it, Porter. That's, that is tough. That's a tough dynamic because um, you want to you want to want to get after a little bit. You just got to got to. Best thing is do let's motion. Let's, let's get out and regroup. We'll go with Eric Bailey with the next question. We're kind of on the same thought process. I mean, there's been tough games in the past. There's been some blowout losses as well. Where do you find that balance between tough love, between challenging the team, between just flushing it, resetting and moving to the next game? Where does that balance lie? You know, there's there's no magic formula. It, it is a balance balance because you know these guys are fragile. We got some young kids in here. We got some. We got a lot of guys that have never had to play the role they're playing, and that's we need we need some we need some we need some guys to play a leadership role, a, a, a star player role, and so there are, a lot of them are new. So it, it is fragile. We got some young guys that are that are you know it's 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 very new. It's 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 very hard to play in that as a young true freshman. Um, so it is, it is, a, it's a fragile balance because you, uh, I mean, I got high standards of what I wanted to do. I mean, I, we expected to win this game. We came in here at halftime. We expected to play well in the second half to do some things better. We talked about what we had to do better in the second half and we didn't do it. We didn't do it. And, um, it was indicative of the first play of the game or second half. We turned it over. We got eaten up on physicality when we talked about that at halftime, they turned it, we turned it over. We just had a unexcused turnover and then all first half. Williams and O'Banner, we were, we were making them catch it off the block. We were winning the battle of the catch. Williams caught it both, both feet in the paint. And then we were doubling and stunting the whole first half. And everyone just stared and looked at Bryce and Williams take Tanner one-on-one. -on -one. And that was indicative of us staying with what we were supposed to do game plan wise in the second half. So um, yeah, we, but the bottom line is, you know, when you say blowouts, we've had two now, uh, both came in the second half, both in the first half, we played well and we got to get, we need depth, everything to get us through the second half. Um, I think when the starters get exhausted, their play goes way down, um, and we got to find that balance. Um, but but whether it's a two point loss against Kansas or an overtime loss against Texas, you got to put it in the bank and move on. Porter, thanks so much for your help. Appreciate it. Ryan Chapman with the next question. Hey, coach, along those same lines, in the second half, first time you guys played, you did a really good job of running out. Um, in transition defense after turnovers held them to only three points off of your guys turnovers in the first half in the second half it kind of snowballed uh, what, what kind of happened there as far as was it just the exhaustion that it kind of set in with the starters to to have that snowballed where they got 23 points off turnovers in the second half yeah our transition defense was terrible um our, we had a lot of turnovers um you know and uh you know we're you know I, i'm supposed to have two or three guys that when the shot goes up we get back we make our wall transition we didn't do that in the second half i thought we did in the first half i thought we did, i thought we stuck to the game plan in the first half and i thought you know guys just tried to take over themselves and that's you know that's guys different roles the guys just you just went down the line all of a sudden you know tanner did a spin move into the thing and then Mo jordan went one on three and then the next thing you know, you know, Jalen, it, it just snowballed in the second half with that. But um, for us to get our transition offense going, it's, it's hard when they scored every time. We, we, we couldn't get any stops. James Hale with the final question for Coach. 
you know, Porter, I hope you can find some offense in the next three games. You know, it was a seven minute from the last of the first half to the beginning of the second. They went on a 19 to nothing run. And you guys couldn't find an answer. I know that's frustrating for you, but I love the way you're talking positively about moving forward. That's got to be one of the biggest things, trying to find some offense in the next three games. I'm, 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 I'm 100 with you, James. I'm aware of it. Um, we, we understand we need some offense. Uh, we need some guys playing well, shooting well, creating well. Um, and we need some depth coming in. Um, you know, so, uh, yep, we, we definitely need some, some guys to step up, make some shots, and get some offense going. You've often talked about Tech and their defense. Their defense is pretty special, isn't it, the way they do things and the length and things that they have all over the court. Yeah, there's some. They're older too. I mean, they, they didn't play. They didn't play a lot of younger guys in the in the in the thing. They're older. They're very very physical. They're very long. You know, there's they start like everybody's six five six six and bigger. So when you switch everything with that length and that veteran physical physical bodies, um, it's 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 very very tough. And uh, they were extremely physical. They play extremely hard. And but they're so long. I mean, look look at their length. And they and they come in with length. And it's it's and they switch everything and they get into your body and they're they're elite defensively. Um, so, like I said, we had to play really well in this building with that 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 crowd getting going, elite 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 atmosphere. Um, and they had it they had it going and we didn't we couldn't get any offense going in the second half and that snowballed our defense. Thanks, Porter. Good luck against Oklahoma State. Thank you. We've got time for one more question. We'll go to Grayson Blaylock. Hi, Coach. Uh, what do you feel this does to your chances of making the tournament? We got we got opportunities. We got we got Oklahoma State at home, West Virginia at home. We got Kansas State on the road. We got the Big Twelve tournament. Um, it would have been a great it would have been a great notch in our belt to for the NCAA tournament. But uh, we got a lot of ball left. Um, don't count us out. We got a lot of ball left, and uh, so. We, we got every big 12 games an opportunity. I know we, I, I get, I get it. I, we got to win some of these. We got to win some of these starting with Saturday. So uh, we got opportunities. Um, we got great opponents that can the thing. We got three regular season games in the conference tournament. So um, we, got a, we got some ball left. We get, we're, we're, you know, don't count us out. Thank you, coach.